Well, I just posted my video a few hours ago that I'm supposed to get inspections tomorrow, and hmm, they're not going to be done. However, our parking pad is poured. Can't park on that till Saturday. And road base is being delivered to finish our gravel driveway to the end. So, yeah, that's where we're at. And Honey's eating hamburger. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh, I was going to say, he's about to hit that tree. This is the same guy got, they got the truck wedged between the house and the side of the mountain. Oh, they sent the same guy? Nice. He's going to go off that side of the mountain if he doesn't stop. Kicking his power divider. Is the skidster there to keep him from getting it on the? Uh. Uh. Oh. Freaking scared me. So that's the same stuff that the parking pad's made out of? What's that from been doing this morning? You already leveled up the front? The first load? Oh, there's already been a load? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he told me that that park, parking pad's gonna go right there. Is this the third load? Yeah. Third load of dirt today. Wow. What do you call this road? What do you call it? Road base. Road base. <clears throat> Would it just take one tractor trailer for our camper area? Yeah, I think it's a couple. Because if this is seven fifty a load, we paid thirty eight hundred for that parking pad. That's really cool how that how that works. I think it's kinda of cool how it's being free. Right? You mm, need to get out of the truck. I wonder how many people would take power lines for that. Ooh, yeah. Hey guys. How are you? Oh, look, look at his face. Look at that. He's, he's looking like a mountain man. <laughs> and I don't have my glasses on, so I'm super squinting. No, I, I, I said that I was not going to get a haircut or shave until this house is done. I brought my scissors home, though. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, so a lot has happened. I think we should do a separate video on the whole <clears throat> well, well, issue. Um, we had hired a deck guy. I've shown you guys some videos where the whole deck was framed. The guy flaked on us. He took a lot of our money. Um, we're not, we're, we're not, not done. We're not, we're not done. done. But um, the builder found another guy immediately to come check out the deck. The deck was not built properly. Three and a half inches out of square. Which doesn't sound like a lot when but you're talking the, about a 32 by 20 deck. It, it adds up. But... Really quick. Anyway, so the new guy said, I'm going to have to tear it all down and rebuild it. Got a quote for that. They 
um, tore down yesterday, most of it, tore a little bit more down today, yeah. and they are re rebuilding it, <clears throat> and it is going on 8 o'clock at night, and they are still rocking out there. Mm -hmm. He's going to, their crew's going to be here in the morning, and it's going to be ready for the hot tub by noon? Tomorrow at noon. Noon tomorrow. <laughs> I mean, the whole deck won't be finished, but they're going to have yeah. the area where the hot tub goes and a walkway for the people delivering the hot tub. So, there you go. That's what's going on. Oh, and what happened this morning? We closed on the house. Oh, yeah. It's so, it actually belongs to us. <laughs> um, however, there are still some uh, outstanding permitting situations that have to be checked out and we can start moving our belongings into the house but we can't start living in the house until those things are inspected so we're looking at wednesday hopefully wednesday yeah. i'll say hopefully we're looking at wednesday you know we we started this adventure um june 18th well we yeah. ended our adventure in littleton on june 18th right right and all this stuff is still in motion and, and, and getting going and all that kind of stuff. And what I can tell you is, is that if, if you choose to do an adventure like this, do it while you're young. Because <laughs> if not, your hair will be as white as my hat. Your hat's not very white. It's kind of yellow. Okay, so is my, so is my hair. So, no, anyway, so anyway, guys, we have, let me show you. Look. New furniture has arrived. I'm sure I'm not showing that very well. There we go. And our first container was delivered today. And there's our cargo trailer. So those two are full of our personal belongings. That we'll go, and it's packed tight as a drum. Both of those packed tight as a drum. So our, um, our friend slash employee Ryan is coming tomorrow to help unload that and start getting all our stuff in the house. They're picking up that container on Monday, Monday and delivering the garage container. On Monday? His fun box. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, and a shout out to my son. He really, um, Blake helped me. Let me go uh, back in the kitchen. I don't know why I can't hold this properly. Okay. Sorry, guys. <laughs> well, I need the bar to hold it. Good, okay. No, but Blake helped me go down and uh, pick up the cargo trailer. He drove it up. Um, he they came to, came to the shop, picked up all the plants. Yeah. Went to Best Buy for the Wi-Fi. Went to Verizon for... Um, anyway. And yesterday they came to the shop and fixed some bathtub situations I had going on there. So, lots has been going on the last couple of days. Yeah. No way I could bring my little scooter bag up here and... Hopefully, go back to work like sooner than later because this is getting old. Oh, stop. You love it. I really don't. So, is anybody watching the Selena series on Netflix? You guys got to tell me. I am loving it. He hates it, not him. He no, I just, it's, it's not that I hate it. It's just that you drill it into the ground. Just the movie was on the, the, re, the original movie was on the but other night. But we watched it every other night. Every other night. We were in Littleton, yeah. Oh, don't listen to her. During COVID, the first season oh, of everybody what... Everybody blames everything on COVID. Talk to you guys <laughs> later. <laughs> Bye. Hey, guys. Look how pretty that is. Except for the pack rack container. <laughs> All right, we're going out back. Look at the garage. We got stuff in it. That's Blake how big it looks now. <laughs> All right, so we explained a little bit how the deck had to be torn down and rebuilt. And these three guys, actually just the one guy tore it down in a day tore this whole thing down and the hot tub is here
Here is the deck. Look how big this thing is. <laughs> it's so much bigger than I thought it was going to be. We should have got a smaller one. Because there's my window. I guess it doesn't impede too much. So does this just... Can we yeah, open... This weather strap right now. Oh. Alright, I'll have to show you that later. But yeah, these guys are amazing. Hey guys, it's Sunday morning. Look who's here. Say hi, everybody. <laughs> All right. It's a mess. It's a worse mess than at our other house because two guys unloaded it and just put it anywhere. They did put it in the right room, I think. There's a few things here that go in the craft room, but... Yeah, this is a beautiful vintage piece that needs a lot of work, but I just put a runner on it because I love it. But wait till you see that. I was like, guys, how am I supposed to organize that? <laughs> and then look at the stuff that fell out of the drawers. I can't even see over there, but it's, I mean, my desk has to be put together. How are you going to put a desk together in this room? <clears throat> Here's Honey's office. He doesn't have as much stuff as I do. I did manage, we got the new couches the other day. Um, here's the living room. And I did manage to take all the new furniture out of the boxes. So this was in a box. So that's our headboard. And I didn't like the furniture that matched the headboard. So I found something that I thought would mesh with it. So these two, well, one of them we were using at the other house. The other one was still wrapped up that one this was wrapped up and this one over here was wrapped up so the fireplace goes here tv goes there here's the closet which you know most people would say oh it's a really small closet for us it's perfectly fine we're not like super into closets we're just not but I think that looks really nice. Um, when the bed's all put together, obviously the mattresses won't be in front of the windows. But yeah, that's what's going on uh, today. Like I said, you know, that furniture was just like kind of put in here in the middle of the room. So this is what I've done so far. Honey has to put the bed frame together. We're not allowed to actually make it look like we're living in here, but we can put the, the bed together as long as I don't make the bed. And I don't start like putting decor everywhere and stuff. We're good. So I put that little entry piece there. And that piece that was in the other house also, I put that at the end of the hallway. <sighs> it's 7.30 if you're wondering. Let's go. Oh, look at this. And I don't know what that tick, 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 tick sound is. I'm going to have to bring that to Honey's attention. <clears throat> so this is how far. Which is really awesome. The monstrous hot tub that I am not thrilled is this big 
I am really not. For some reason inside the store, it didn't look like it was going to take up, you know, I don't know what that is, like an eighth of the deck. But I am super stoked. Tomorrow, the water feature starts up there and winds around that rock cropping. I am stoked. They are supposed to be like this close to finishing by the end of the day today, including steps over here and railing all the way on that side. Now, here's the thing. <coughs> um, be careful, Shiva. I don't want railing over here. And the reason I don't is because I want to be able to see my water feature without looking through railing. So they're going to put the railing up because there's still more inspections coming and it's high enough off the ground that it has to have railing to meet code. Over here, it doesn't because it's close enough to the ground and they're going to push more of this in so that you can kind of just step off the deck. But look at all the rocks. That's all rock that, you know, is in the earth here. But, yeah. It's a beautiful morning. We get... There's our satellite uh, for um, internet. We're going to have another one up there for um, direct TV. Anyway, I got to go make coffee for the guys that are coming. I promised them coffee and muffins, and I got to get to it. Hey, guys, I meant to do a video. It's Monday morning. I meant to do a video at the end of the day yesterday, but we were exhausted. So here's our bedroom. We're not allowed to open boxes yet, which sounds weird. We're not allowed. I mean, we did closing on Friday. But we haven't passed all inspections because uh, they haven't come to do all the inspections. So uh, the boulder let us put our stuff in here. But um, I did get a lot of stuff like reorganized. Like I went through all the boxes. The correct boxes are in the correct room. This is the cabinet honey built yesterday. I love that. We ordered two of those. And those are going in the laundry room as pantry storage. So there's the shelves. I really love the new furniture. So this beautiful vintage piece that you guys might remember from the other house is going to be the new coffee bar. This is what I got done on my room yesterday. So I need my desk put together. It's, it's a real simple. This piece that was on the coffee bar before is going to hang on this wall over my desk. And I'll be able to decorate that for Christmas. So, yeah, all of this is my white storage all the way across to the end. Um, I'm not sure where these are going to go yet. These are from the Playhouse slash Paint Studio. Then I've got this stack over here. And then I've got a stack in there. And the same exact stack on this side and then there's some stuff up there and for Anna's picture and then um honey's office his desk is gonna go in that corner his gun cabinet <clears throat> we literally ordered this love seat to go in the living room with the oversized chair and we ordered the big long couch to go in this room. Couldn't get it in the door. They even took all the framing off the door and still couldn't get it in here. So that was a bummer. And yesterday, after the fiasco with the old deck guy, look what we got. Hot tubs over here. I'd go out, but the plumber 
as you can see, is out there working on some septic situation. And it's going to be a madhouse here today. We've got the septic inspection. We've got the deck people coming back. We have the water feature people that are going to be here. Um, the GC should be here any minute. Seems like there's... Oh, and the, the pack rack container is getting picked up and the second one getting dropped off. Here's our kind of a entryway. And I would push this couch back to meet the carpet line. But it's so... The, this couch is 11 feet long. So by the time it goes over, it makes this space smaller and I just didn't like it. So. I got the whiskey barrel out here and I got a plant on top of it. I want to get something that like really drapes down, but it'll only last one season. <coughs> but yeah. Good morning, world. All right, guys, I'm going to cut this off. I'm going to put this video together. And next week, next week, <coughs> this stuff starts going away into the cabinets. And yeah. All right. Hey, at least we closed, right? <laughs>